What is up, Midway Mayhem fans? This is Dan, and we are checking back in from the Universal Orlando Resort for yet another Jurassic World Velocicoaster construction update. And we're hearing something special is going on today. Before we head inside the parks, let's go check up on a friend. During Mardi Gras, we always check up on the bee tree. It's looking very festive right now. Decked out very nicely. The rumored Universal Studio store looks to be about the same, except for some electrical cable now coming out of the pipes. And we now have an outline right here. Kind of looks like a glow, doesn't it? Big circle. Hmm. Other than that, it's looking to be just about the same. Again, big circle or half circle right there. Hmm. Front of the building looking awesome. Big lift right here, and we see new panels right there. And here's a better look at some of those panels. A little bit of a universal blue, wouldn't you think? And one last look at everything going on here for the rumored Universal Studio Store. Let's get inside of Islands and check out what's going on with the Lost Coaster. Hello, Islands of Adventure, the lighthouse right there. Temperature somewhere in the 60s, partly cloudy. It's beautiful though. It's not going to be too busy. Now the counter Haggard's will be open and later. I ordered this. No. Go Here's a whole bunch of food. And then over here, yeah. ticket booths. Have a little bit of a wait, not too bad. Turnstiles, all of them are open, including the center one. I want to do that one. Yep, no way to get through temperature check, security, or through the front entrance. We are on our way. Our first stop of the day is going to be the Islands of Adventure Trading Company and exciting stuff. We have Velocicoaster merch right there. Adult t-shirt with track blue on there. This is grand opening. 2021 price on this one for an extra small we see is $25 around the side over here another adult tee white with the rafters and track nothing on the back except for stats lots of stats I love it tank tops over here more stats on there with the track and rafters this one right here it says must go faster I like that. Velocicoaster has the DNA double helix. See if there's anything on the back. Nothing on the back of that one. Another t-shirt there. We have some tumblers. Kids t-shirt right there. With some of the same designs. This one, Chaos Happens. Jurassic World Velocicoaster. I like that one a lot. That one is 30 bucks. Don't see anything on the back. We have all sorts of plush. This one right here says more teeth. I love that. Look how bright and vibrant that is. And ah, it's a blue raptor attack. You can see more plush merch over there. Shot glasses. I have over 300 shot glasses. Maybe this one will uh, join the collection. What could go wrong? We have coffee mugs. More plush. Or tank tops. This is a nice coffee mug though. I like it with all the stats and whatnot on there. Nice design. We have lanyards. And here we can see some socks. Also AP holders. Lanyard pouch. Magnet set. Uh oh, that one's gonna be coming home. We have other pens. We have grand opening pens over here. Other things like that. Jurassic World hoodie. And all those lanyards look nice though with the track. Well, that's gonna do it, I think, for all the Velocicoaster merch over here. All right, let's check out the wait times. Park is open until six, and the sign is acting a little weird. Doctor Doom, 25 minutes. Spider-Man was 45 minutes. Seuss Trolley, 45 minutes. Karasu Cell, I think, is five minutes. Incredible Hulk, I think, is 60 minutes. River Adventure is 15 minutes. Popeye and Bluto's was right now. And there's the Velocicoaster, it's running right now.
Dang it, bird, what have I said? Get off my sneech. the Jurassic World Velocicoaster and we've already seen several test runs other than merchandise there's something exciting we got to check out the walls are down around the paddock area water cannon. The amazing adventures of Spider-Man, well, the front entrance still under construction. Work walls are now up around Dudley's. All the construction walls, all of them. Here's the smoking area over by Jurassic Park River Adventure and we know it's been torn out. What could be going here? Hmm, maybe a new photo opportunity spot? Here at Jurassic Outfitters? Well, of course we have Velocicoaster merch right over here. Some of the same ones we saw at the front of the park. Not saying anything different. And now we're over by Wall City, but we can't really call it that anymore because the walls are down. Let's go get a better look. Isn't it glorious? Who's ready for some up close views? I am. Again, warp walls are down. You can get right up here next to the track. So awesome.
We got the misters on now. Well, we've seen a couple test runs today, not as many as we were really hoping for, but hey, at least we had a chance to see the walls down. The ride is still running right now, but uh, well, it's almost 6.30, it's time to head out. <laughs> well guys, that's going to do it for another update here from the Universal Orlando Resort for the Jurassic World Velocicoaster, and very exciting stuff as we had a chance to see the ride running with the walls down around Wall City. Exciting stuff, we got some up close views, and hopefully we're going to see it run a lot more opening day or soft openings is hopefully just a few short weeks away we'll see of course we'll let you know so if you like what we do follow us on instagram facebook youtube and twitter at midway mayhem and i will see you out on the midway